going on everyone? RC84 here like always. Thanks for watching. As you guys can see here I have this big massive scale RC battle tank. This my friends is a 1 6 scale battle tank from a company called 21st Century Toys. Uh, this tank came out in around about 2000 and 2003 era. Uh, not exactly sure on the Pacific year it actually came out. I saw a label in the battery department saying 2003, so yeah, I guess it's from 2003. It's 2017 now, soon to be 2018, which is kind of crazy. This year has really just flew by quick. It feels like just the other day it was summer, and now it's winter, but living here on the coast of North Carolina, our winters are really not that harsh, harsh. Uh, we don't get any snow or anything. If we do, it's very rare that we get snow here on the beach. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> but uh, I acquired this tank through the Facebook market page. Uh, I was just sitting there scrolling through uh, the other day, just kind of looking at like what RCs are for sale in my local area. And I came across this bad boy, and the guy actually lived in my hometown. And so I uh, mentioned him about it and stuff. And the guy wanted to do no cash. He just wanted to do a trade on another RC or something that replaced the tank and so I ended up trading him one of my RC vehicles because I got plenty of these things just here in the room just sitting up that I don't you know, either don't play with anymore or whatnot. But I ended up trading him the Tamana Unimog 425 on a CC01 chassis. If you guys remember in the summer 2017 I did a complete build series on the Unimog and uh, if you guys want to see that, I'll put the link down in the description box where you can see that build series on that. Uh, somewhat of a series. <laughs> I didn't have a little issues with it. But I ended up, uh, ended up trading him that vehicle for this vehicle. Um, so yeah. But uh, just massive scaled out. It's a World War II tank. And uh, it kind of looks like almost like a Sherman based uh, type tank. But uh, just fully scaled very heavy as well even without the battery in it, uh, it this thing is very heavy I'm not exactly sure on what the way of it is but it is pretty heavy now talk about the battery let me show you guys the battery here is the battery that goes in it this is a 12 point volt um, AGM battery pretty massive big now I'm not exactly sure why such a big battery for this vehicle um, but it again it is pretty heavy and uh, so I guess you know you need a good heavy battery to push this vehicle but uh, really awesome now the vehicle does need a few TLC does need well need some TLC um, there's a few things that are missing from the tank which the guy told me about he's like a lot of the skill pieces I had for the tank is missing I was like that's not a problem because I can track stuff down and go to my local toy store and, and find uh, you know, guns and buckets and stuff like that to put on this thing another thing is missing is the top turret piece or no, the actually the cannon is missing off of it and from what I've seen a lot of pictures uh, this is a common thing to break on these things a lot or get knocked off or whatever uh, so I have to kind of like either find the cannon piece or uh, try to custom make something which I'll probably end up custom making for it because uh, parts for this thing is not there's not a lot of parts out out there for it mostly like the wheel assembly and stuff like motors and stuff like that is out there but as far as like scale pieces and stuff like that hadn't seen it now here is the uh, remote control very simple toy grade controller uh, you got your joysticks up here to move the vehicle uh, up here is your buttons for the firing of uh, the cannon which does fire I think uh, these have like little orange dot, uh, darts that they shoot out uh, little plastic darts nothing like spikes or anything like that but uh, it has the sound effects machine guns uh, the motor sound uh, the turret can turn left and right uh, so yeah now I really hadn't tested this vehicle out yet to see if it actually worked I actually kind of just like uh, kind of took the guy's word for it he's like it works it just needs a new battery uh, so I ended up getting a new battery today for it uh, so I'll have to test out and see if it actually works. I think, you know, the guy was pretty cool, so I think it, it does work. Uh, just have to go through it a little bit and see, you know, what needs to be done and stuff like that. Uh, but other than all that, guys, it is awesome. Uh, <laughs> I can't wait to get this thing running and uh, scale it out and everything. Um, 
probably all I'm going to do is full restoration on it, uh, strip it down, paint it, everything, scale it out, maybe get some uh, some some uh, scale figures to go in it because it definitely has that. Uh, let me get, give you guys a uh, close-up view of the tank, so let me grab the camera. Hopefully, I don't do anything to mess the camera up. All right, so, <laughs> all right. Well, now I can't zoom back because I'm already at my uh, maximum of, <laughs> but, uh, all right. So, uh, as you see, really nice and detailed, a lot of cooler work. Now, look, the uh, the machine gun here piece is broke off, which is not a problem. I can replace that. Uh, we've got the old wheel here. Now, look at the tracks on this thing. Massive, huge tracks. The wheels are very massive, big. Uh, even the back wheel. And I just really love that World War II sound. Or, not sound. Uh, that was my phone actually going off. That's eBay. Let me know some kind of deal is going on. But um, I really love the, the, the World War II look of this tank. I think it's definitely going to be a great scale tank to, to use. Um, but yeah. So, but yeah, that's the tank, guys. This is my new, new little project to come to the channel and back up without knocking anything over. But as you guys can see here on the workstation, you can just exactly see how big this tank really is. So, uh, yeah. Now, you guys are probably asking, well, where can you buy one of these? How much did it cost? Uh, I did see them on eBay uh, for roughly around three to four hundred dollars. If you want it brand new, you're looking at about seven hundred dollars, and that's from uh, eBay and Amazon as well. So, uh, kind of gives you an idea. I kind of uh, got this thing for a you know, pretty good price. <laughs> You know, I gave up a vehicle that I spent maybe $250 in, and I got this big, humongous tank. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, I don't know if I got a good deal, or he got a good deal, or what. But, um, I do need you guys' help on this tank. If you guys know where I can get parts for this tank, or, um, like, the running of it, um, you know, any kind of information about this tank, you know, where I could get uh, parts for it, electronics, uh, stuff like that, let me know. Uh, comment down in the, uh, the comment area and just let me know where I can get uh, parts for this thing, if there are out there. I've been trying to look myself and I hadn't really uh, came across too much, just, you know, basically, you know, the wheels, the wheels and uh, the batteries for it. That's all I really have seen. I hadn't seen anything else for it. But, you know, if you guys know anything, let me know. And uh, comment down below. Let me know where I can get these parts at and stuff like that. But, um, but yeah. So, uh, like I said, this is going to be my next little project here on the channel. And uh, try to get this tank back to rolling and get it out there and do some really cool videos with it. I definitely going to like doing some videos with this tank. Uh, but, yeah. All right, guys, so uh, thanks for watching, and again, help me out if you can. And uh, make sure you check out the channel's Facebook page. Uh, it's facebook.com forward slash RC84films. That way you can see pictures of the process on putting this tank all back together and scaling it out and all that good stuff, which I'll be doing a video series here on it soon. But, all right, so... Again, thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next video. Uh, might be on the tank. It might be something else. Who knows? All right, guys, thanks for watching, and I will check you all out later.